head back to Larissa, who's got a double dose of cuteness for us right now. Yes, I do. My goodness, we are going to meet a rescue in a second that really lives up to its name. They're called Angels Among Us Pet Rescue, and they are in northern Georgia, and they recently rescued, or I should say they recently helped with a rescue that took 630 animals that were living in horrible conditions in just a, a puppy mill slash breeding situation, and take a look at these poor babies. They need Needed so much help, and the two that we are going to meet in just a second were part of that wonderful rescue. Their names are Poco and Liana, and they looked not so great. That's Liana, and now look at how beautiful she is on the right. And that's Poco, a cocker spaniel. And let's meet them now with Tiffany and Caitlin. Again, they are located in northern Georgia. Hi, you guys. Thank you so much for everything you do. Hi, thank you so much for having us. We're so excited to let you see these two little babies. Oh, and they really are precious. Tell us all about them. Obviously, they didn't have the best beginning of life, but they can have the best forever. Absolutely. They're going to be Cinderella stories, definitely. Mm -hmm. We're looking at actually Leanna right now playing, and she is about eight. She's a little diva. She loves affection in every single way and just likes to burrow down in your arms. And Poco is about six and he is energetic. He's playful. Um, when he, his hair goes back after being shaved, he had so many, so many mats that we had to pretty much shave him down because he was in such horrific condition. But once his hair grows back, it's going to be like hashtag hair goals for him. <laughs> He's the most gorgeous cocker spaniel, beautiful calendar dog cocker. I'm trying to Absolutely. get my hair to match. Like yours. <laughs> no, he's beautiful though. What a beautiful, rich chocolate color that he is. And you know, I just want to make a quick mention to people that dogs that come from that kind of situation, they haven't had a lot of love, but they have so much love to give. And I know that you said on the phone earlier that some of the animals that you rescued from this horrible situation actually were sleeping upright in their crate for the first couple couple days because that's all they knew and they're slowly learning to be dogs and enjoy comfortable couches and hugs and lots of pets so thank you so much for that hopefully somebody out there will fall in love and go to your website to find out more about those two and all the others that you saved and there are so many around the country that need you so head to your local rescue or shelter find the one that speaks to you and needs you and you need them and give them an adoption ever after Thank you, Larissa. A couple little cuties there. We're going right. to find them some forever homes for sure.